In this video, you're going to learn 17 tools and software to better manage, streamline, and scale your online business. So keep on watching. Hi, my name's Aurelius, and on this channel, I share my tips, tool reviews, and tutorials to help you build your business with online tech. So if you don't want to miss any future videos, then subscribe below, turn on notifications too, so that you don't miss a thing. Before I move ahead, this video is sponsored by AppSumo and some of the tools I'll be sharing in this video are from AppSumo. AppSumo is your go-to place for tools you need to grow your business. They find and partner with the hottest tech companies so that you can access special deals on their products. If you need help deciding which tools are right for you, I've put together all my favorite AppSumo tools in one collection on this page. Use the link in the description below to get 10% off your next purchase. For links, resources, and timestamps, I'll link up in the description below, so go ahead and check that out. All right, without further delay, let's get to the 17 tools and software. Okay, so the first tool I wanna to share with you is called Boost. Boost is an app that's featured on AppSumo, and it lets you create a seamless experience for your visitors to opt in for your freebie. So let's say a lead magnet and your boost links can be shared on social media or anywhere else you'd like. With boost, you no longer have to have your visitors opt in to a sign up form, but rather click or select one of these options to then claim your freebie or lead magnet. So all you need to do is create a boost link and fill in all the details such as your target URL, where your lead magnet is located or whatever you wanna give away. Select the social apps that you want to include, such as the ones shown here. Disable or uncheck the ones you don't want. Save changes. Select your email marketing service from the dropdown or you can also integrate it with Zapier. Boost will shorten the link. This is a link that you wanna share on social media or other places. When a visitor lands on your link, they'll be shown all these options to log in to then claim your freebie or lead magnet. Once they've signed up, they'll be synced to your email marketing platform. So with Boost, you can experience higher conversion rates because now you no longer require your visitors to opt in to a traditional opt-in form, but instead connect with one of the social apps that you enable in your Boost account. All right, onto the next tool. Have you ever been to some sort of online shopping website and all of a sudden from the corner, you can see a notification pop up saying that this person from this location just bought? Well, you can do the exact same thing and this is called a social proof notification service and the tool that you can use is called Wiser Notify. Wiser Notify is a tool that delivers customizable social proof notifications and widgets to build trust and increase sales. This is another app featured on the AppSumo Marketplace, so go ahead and check that out. Links in the description below. This is what the back end looks like. You can see all the different styles that you can choose from. So live, we've got 100 visitors are online now. This is all fully customizable. You've also got recent things such as just purchased or check out our latest video and some rating sort of templates that you can use as well. The notification is fully customizable. This is the back end, as you can see. If you're selling anything online, then Wiser Notify is going to help you build social proof on your website. Next tool is called Switchy, another tool that's featured on AppSumo. Switchy not only allows you to shorten long links, but it also allows you to retarget your visitors at the same time. All you need to do is create a new link, add your pixel ID if you do want to retarget visitors that click on the link. You can add your pixel ID from Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, and more. In addition, if you wanna do some testing, there's a built-in A-B testing right here where you can add different URLs and assign different percentages for each URL. URL. So by using Switch here, you're not wasting your traffic. You can retarget visitors who have already clicked on your links. Next up, if you want to create professional looking email signatures, then Scribe is the tool you want to use. The great thing about Scribe is that you're able to add call to action buttons and also a banner too, together with your email signature. Once you filled all the details that you'd like on your banner, click on install signature and copy HTML code or Gmail, whatever mail service that you use, so I'll click on Gmail code. In your Gmail account, go to settings, then under general, you wanna look for signature right here and create a new signature. I'm gonna call this demo. And then all I need to do now is just paste it in. And here's what my email signature looks like. And now when I compose a new email, you can see the email signature that I created. In addition, when I respond to other people, the email signature will also be inserted. The next tool is called Better Uptime. If you've got a website of any sort, then it's crucial to make sure that your website is always online and available. The last thing you want is for your website to go down when you're launching a new product or releasing something new. That could mean a lot of sales lost. To summarize, Better Uptime is an uptime monitoring service that alerts you when your site is down 
while providing screenshots and error logs for debugging. The setup is so simple and you don't need to install anything on your website. Simply enter your URL that you wanna monitor and select whether you want to alert when your site becomes unavailable or doesn't contain a certain keyword or doesn't respond to ping. Now here's the best part. You can select whether to send email, SMS or call you when your website actually goes down. So with better uptime, you and or your team will get alerted if your website does go down. The next tool is called Silverbots. Silverbots is a customizable Facebook Messenger bot that helps respond to customer inquiries and automate sales, marketing and support. It's actually an alternate to ManyChat. With Silverbots, you can create all sorts of Messenger bots from live chat to e-commerce to quizzes to even sequences, as you can see just right here, send sequence of messages. You can see Silverbots using it right here on their website. If I click on the Messenger bot here, we can chat with Silverbots. I'm going to continue, and now I've got the Messenger bot, and this is what the Messenger bot looks like. It may appear real, but it's actually just a bot. So let's say pricing. The bot will then respond automatically based on my response. So it didn't quite understand it, but it did match it with the closest response. So how much does Silverbots cost? And we can say yes. And now they've provided the price list and this is all automatically done with their messenger bot. So do check out Silverbots if you wanna automate some of your support and sales. Okay, next up you've got Stock Unlimited. And as the name suggests, you're getting unlimited stock images, audio, fonts, templates, and much more. For a one-time payment of $49, it's a steal of a deal considering you're getting unlimited stock images, audio, and templates. Just to give you an example, let's search for pancakes, which is my favorite breakfast food. Here are all the results from my search term, and now I can use this for my website or marketing collateral. The next tool I want to talk about is called Zapier. Zapier will allow you to connect one app with another or several others, like in this example, when I get a new email on Gmail, then take this action, which is to copy the attachment from Gmail to Dropbox. Then after that, alert me in Slack about the new Dropbox file. All this can be done within Zapier. And the best part is you don't need to be a developer or be tech savvy to know how to use it. So if you're looking to automate your business, then consider using Zapier. Next tool is called Notion. Notion is more than just a note-taking tool. You can actually create and manage your projects using Notion, as well as collaborate with team members. In this example, we can see a roadmap for a project and all you need to do really is just drag and drop and that's how it works. So this is using the Kanban system. So from not started to in progress, then to complete. There are several templates that you can choose from. So under design, you've got roadmap, user research database, meeting notes, under education, there are quite a lot of other templates, engineering, human resources, and much more. I used to use Evernote to take notes and monday.com to manage all my projects, but have then since moved to Notion because Notion can do pretty much what they can do. Next tool is called Bonjoro. With Bonjoro, you can create personalized videos for your customers. So you can do things like welcome new customers and thank loyal customers as well. You can integrate Bonjoro with your email marketing service. So any new subscribers you get, you can then contact them directly and record the video right there on Bonjoro. Once you've recorded your video message, this is what you can then send out to your subscriber, member or customer. We live in a noisy world, so if you do want to stand out and make your business or company different, then use a service like Bonjoro to send personalized video messages to your subscribers and customers. Next up, we've got an all-in-one marketing system called GrooveFunnels. With GrooveFunnels, you can create landing pages, sales pages, sell your products using GrooveSell, create an affiliate program using Groove Affiliate, build your email list using Groove Mail, create a membership site using Groove Member, and host your videos using Groove Video. If you're looking for a solution to build your websites and sell your products, then check out Groove Funnels. I've also got a video which I'll link up in the card right here that explains a little bit more about Groove Funnels. Okay, next tool is going to help you identify which keywords to use in your content and to also analyze competitors. That very tool is called Uber Suggest. All you need to do is just enter a keyword or a domain. I'm just going to enter social media marketing. And now it's given me some valuable insights such as the search volume and SEO difficulty. If we look down, we can see some suggested keywords as well. And these are some other keywords that may not be as competitive when it comes to SEO. 
Looking down, you've got content ideas. This will give you some suggestions as to what types of titles, topics will resonate and get engagement. We can see the number of engagements on Facebook and Pinterest, and that gives you an indication as to what types of topics are quite popular within that niche. Right off the bat, I can see how to create a social media marketing plan from scratch it has 296 backlinks. So that means it's been shared a lot. I could then take note of this. So then for a future post, I could talk about it. The next tool is called Rev, which is a transcription service. So if you wanna get your audio transcribed, it starts from $1.25 per minute and it's transcribed by human professionals. Or if you want the automated machine generated version, then it just comes down to 25 cents per minute. So this will be handy if you do things like audio interviews or you wanna transcribe your videos. I've used Rev to transcribe my videos into captions or video captions. What I do then is upload it to YouTube so then there will be captions on the video. So if you're looking to transcribe anything, then I highly recommend Rev. Next up, you've got Orphonic. Orphonic is a tool that will allow you to upload your audio files. So whether you do podcasts or videos, it'll automatically level the audio levels, normalize it and also remove any background noise. In fact, I used Orphonic to level all my audios that you see on my YouTube channel. It's really simple to use. All you need to do is just extract the audio of your video, or if it's just the audio, then that's all you need. Select the file, select whether you want the Apple file to be MP3, a WAV file, or anything else, and then choosing what audio algorithms you wanna use. So adaptive leveler, loudness, normalization, filtering, noise and hum reduction. I like to keep it at the defaults, but also at the noise and hum reduction. Once you start production, it'll then process your audio file and then provide you with a download link for your cleaned audio. Next up, are you looking for a free screen recording tool that will allow you to record your screen as well as yourself at the same time? Well, look no further, Loom is the tool that you want to get. I've got a full step-by-step -step tutorial on using Loom, so go ahead and check that out in the card right here. All right, next up, have you ever wanted to take a screenshot, but what you wanna take a screenshot of goes beyond what you see on your screen. So in other words, you wanna take a full page screenshot. Well, the way to do it is to use a browser extension called Go Full Page, which is a full page screen capturing tool. It sits on your browser up here. So if I click on this button once, it's going to take a screenshot of the whole page. And now what I can do is save it as a PDF or just download it as a PNG file. The last and final tool that I wanna share with you is called Designer. Designer is an ebook creation tool which will allow you to convert any Word document into a professional looking ebook. In addition, the most powerful feature is that you can take all your blog posts and then turn it into an ebook. On the back end, you can click on import from blog post or URL. Next up, enter the URLs of all the blog posts that you wanna turn into an ebook. I've entered three different blog posts there. I'm gonna click on next. Choose a template from designer. I'll just click on this one here. And in just a matter of seconds, designer converted my blog post into an ebook format, as you can see. I've got a full tutorial on designer, so if you wanna learn more, I'll link up the card right here. All right, so there we go. I hope a couple of these tools will help you in your business and your marketing. If you like this video, by all means, hit that like button. And if you're new, subscribe below, turn on notifications too, so that you don't miss any future tips, tool reviews, and tutorials that I post up here on this channel. Thanks so much for watching to the very end, and do stay tuned to watch these next relevant videos.